let's check this out. Make sure we're coming in live. And there we are. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Good morning, good morning, everyone. Hope you're doing well. This is Chicho, and welcome to my channel. Welcome to another live stream. Today, today is January 28th, 2021. And we're doing the first of seven live streams that we've scheduled for the next six days, I think. At least we're going to do se uh, we're going to do at least seven. We're doing two today. Okay, later on this afternoon, we're going to do a discussion on education. But this live stream, I figured uh, for this seven set, we would start it off by playing with kittens. <laughs> but where are the kittens? The kittens got up with me this morning at around, uh, I got up early, uh, 4.30, 5 o'clock in the morning. And that's what they usually do. I usually get up fairly early in the morning. And you know, 5 o'clock, 5.30, I'm up and, up and about and doing my stuff. And the kittens have been here with us uh, for about a week on Charter Days. Thank you very much for the Twitch Prime sub. Uh, so the kittens have been here with us for about um, a week. So their schedule has been, they've been getting up with me and sort of, playing around doing their business and whatnot and then while i do you know get online and check my news reply to comments and do my stuff they snooze again and then they get up and start playing around 8 30 9 o'clock and i play with them this time they didn't go to sleep uh when they got up with me so they've been going mad for like three hours four hours on charter day say chicho hope you and chad are having a great day it's doing a fantastic day on charter days thank you very much to you as well brother of course right the real uh mc mike how are you doing morning morning and cats i'm gonna go bring the cast to you guys did you get the comma call it no not yet brother i sent a uh i did a second uh ebay uh you know issue whatever claim and the guy finally got in touch with me he goes oh i'm trying to sort it out i sent it to this guy and you're trying to get that comic to you but i have until next week uh to let ebay know if it's been resolved or not the guy uh he tried to refund me 60 dollars where i said okay i'll accept the 60. i went to accept it and then it didn't go through so i'm like dude like you even refunding uh, partial refund doesn't even work with them and he's like oh i'm so sorry it just didn't go through i don't know why and so i'm gonna give him until the end of the week and i'm gonna uh until tomorrow and i'm gonna send him a message saying listen ebay needs to know uh we got to resolve this so we'll see where it goes we'll see where it goes great lasani how are you doing hey chicho how are you doing doing well hey chicho debs how are you doing thing bobber i've decided via is a beautiful name it was in my head randomly awesome awesome thing bobber gang let me go get the kittens for you guys really they're usually up and about for the last five days or so they've been up and around around this time and i've been playing with them and stuff but they played hard for the last three hours four hours so they passed out <laughs> I'm gonna go bring him here. Check on chat. I'll give my intro uh, while the kittens are here, and uh, you know we can wake them up. We'll see. The kittens when they're passing out, they're passing out hard. But every now and then I can get them rousing again, or we can just watch them sleep and uh, and just chill, talk about whatever. Howdy, Chicho, Felix. I'm assuming you've seen the insanity going. On. Oh, for sure, brother. Some of the fun stuff. And I'm gonna allow that for some reason. Auto mod zapped it. Uh, hello all and chicho cobalt how are you doing regal 306 chicho how are you this afternoon i'm doing fantastic man I had a nice yogurt cereal fruit breakfast the setup looks so cozy so cozy man so cozy i hope i gotta sort it out too uh, on try today's i really want those comics that's the reason i bit on that a lot uh but it is what it is the man the legend smith how are you doing why is GS AMC skyrocketing? Well, AMC's down today, <laughs> like ten, eleven dollars in it for the uh, uh, tendies. Block from buying more. Haha, -ha, Smith, are you? Let me go get the kittens for you guys, gang. So at least we have the kittens. At least it's supposed to be a kitten stream, so we have the kittens here anyway.
say hi to everyone. Come on. There you go. What's going on? Here, I'll put you guys in. Come on. Come on, Via. Oh, sorry, Sal. The one with the collar is Sal. We decided to uh, put a collar on one of them. Okay. <laughs> Come on, Sal. Via. And I think we had them wrong on the last stream. The names. They're super cool, man. They're so nice and chill. What's going on? I moved you guys. The odds are they'll probably go back to sleep. Right. They're sticking it to the Wall Street hedge fund. I don't know if they are. MC Mike, they are to a certain degree to some of them, but that, that that's the low hanging fruit of Wall Street, right? That's the low hanging fruit of Wall Street. Chicho, don't get bit by walking <laughs> tigers from the slumber. No, I won't. <laughs> Ding bobber. Where did these cats come from? They were from uh, Toronto. Uh, we had them. Uh, we got them from Toronto. They're like fire, right on. Hey cats, what's up, Chicho? Dragons, how are you doing? Greetings, blessings, Dr. B. Chicho, craziness happening in the markets. And happening in the markets, indeed. Graham, take it to the moon. <laughs> Cheryl, oh, and hi, oh, Cheryl, how are you doing? Jack's leftover. Chicho, did, uh, hey, cats, I got an iPhone advert before the stream. Do they know who they're dealing with? <laughs> Maybe. Can some examples what's happening with whatever is going on? Sure, Elder God. Let me give you guys a. No, the cats are just clean. Let them, we'll let them clean themselves for a bit. Gang, I'm gonna do my quick little intro. Unfortunately, the stuff is gonna pop on top of the kitties. But gang, if you want to follow this work, if you want to know what this work is about, I'm on Patreon. Patreon.com forward slash chicho c h y c h o. I don't put anything behind paywall. Everything's Creative Commons. Share, share, like. We got construction going on outside. <laughs> the crazy construction. Hopefully it's not gonna last a while. Uh, for those of you who've been supporting this work on Patreon, thank you very much for the support. Uh, it is in large part because of your support that we're able to do this. We are live streaming on Twitch, twitch.tv forward slash Chicho Live, C-H-Y-C-H-O-L-I-V-E. If you wanna participate in the chat, which is happening over here, Where's the finger? Over here, over here, over here, over here, over here. Uh, Twitch is where you want to be at. And gang, thank you for the support. Thank you for the subs. Thank you for the follows. Thank you for being here. Thank you for the conversations. Okay. I do announce these live streams 30 minutes before we go live on Minds, LO, VK, Gap, Parlor when it comes online, and Twitter. For live streams, when we don't have any visuals, we will upload the live streams, uh, the audio to SoundCloud as podcasts, and they should be available on your favorite uh, podcasting platform, including Spotify and iTunes. And we will be uploading these streams to YouTube, BitChute, Rumble, and I've tried doing it on Odyssey. I'm having hiccups on Odyssey, gang, um, for a few different reasons, uh, with the phone linking up and... Uh, with the, they need name name and address and all this crap to link things up to because what it is is for every video I'm uploading to Odyssey I had a certain amount of Odyssey money there coins there right so I used all those up to upload whatever videos we uploaded so far and I don't have any more Odyssey coins to upload any more videos so as soon as I'm able to 
get that sorted out where the Odyssey coins go on the cancer plane. I'll start uploading to Odyssey again. But for now, gang, YouTube, BitChute, Rumble. Everything goes to BitChute and Rumble. Uh, SensorTube doesn't allow us to load everything. Gang, thanks for being here. Aside from that, let me just get caught up with chat. And the cats are awake. We can play. <laughs> play time with kitty cats. Toronto cats. So they think they're better than everyone are basically living dead Monday to Friday. <laughs> Uh, yes it's a and by the way gang just to let you know oops just to let you know regarding uh gamestop and what's going on in the markets for the first hour of tomorrow's stream which is a mathematics stream we'll talk about it okay i'll lay down how i see things playing out and why they're playing out this way and what this all means and whatnot um so i can give you a quick lowdown today regarding gamestop Yes, it's everywhere. Okay, Elder God. Let me explain GameStop. Institutional investors got caught short selling. Okay, uh, Papa selling more than 100% of the shares existed. Popular where Reddit found out, but knowing that they would have to buy it back eventually. Yeah, one guy turned 50, yeah, into 50 million. I saw that Smith. Graham linked that up to us. We can't buy it, Jim. BB in Robin Hood today. Indeed, and they control the markets, they control the game, right? Hobo Bridges 81 H E Cho. Hope you're about doing well. Oh my god, Elder <laughs> God. <laughs> Smith. We can sell, we just can't buy. But who uh we sell to is nobody can buy. Yeah. Well if you can't buy on Robinhood, they can buy on the other exchanges, right? Fidelity is functional in case it's helpful for anyone. Yeah. Right. And different kinds of investors. I haven't uh, seen spider-man on the live streams for a while now i wonder if he's doing okay i think he's doing okay i think uh, spider-man need to take a break from uh all the politics stuff that was coming up uh mainly because of the elections and stuff right uh and i don't blame him right so i think uh spider-man just uh is taking a break uh he is welcome anytime he wants man spider-man is, is one of the kindest dudes uh we've come across uh lots of love to spider-man uh, I hope he's watching uh, and uh, just so you guys know we're going less and less politics more and more real life okay we are doing our current event streams and stuff but there's a lot going on uh, but Trump derangement syndrome it's not even over yet they, they're even blaming <laughs> this game spot stuff on Trumpism it's like crazy cute cats thanks on Charlie today's uh, Sal has been scratched. Sal is the one by the fire. He's been scratching himself a little bit. Uh, so, rules for thee, but not for me. Indeed, Graham. Indeed. Is there something behind the stock market situation, Elder God? It's pizza time for Spider Man. Pizza time for Spider Man. Gang, just a quick. <clears throat> we'll get into detail on GameSpot tomorrow in the math stream right but because a lot of people want to know what's going on with GameSpot and the uh gain stop and the markets and stuff like this basically name of the game is this right when you get into the stock market you have to have an appreciation for you're playing a game that is rigged right you're just choosing to play and hopefully you can take some money cream off the top as you learn how the game is played and can optimize your ability to take a little bit of cream off the top you have to appreciate that you can be knocked out anytime that the central powers want to knock you out they make the rules they've made the rules they can change the rules anytime they want they have access to unlimited funds at interest free right no matter how much how much money there's seven and a half billion people on this planet have seven and a half billion people on this planet can generate those point zero 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 one percent that control the money supply can crush the seven and a half billion people that can generate whatever money they want right because all they do is press a button on the computer and 
they generate trillions of dollars for themselves, right? The best example you can have is the bailouts in the United States of America, right? Overnight, they sent trillions of dollars to Wall Street, but they can't send Americans $600, $1,400. It takes them months to roll this out, right? So that should give you an idea of how much money they control and how much money the retail investor controls. Now, regarding GameStop or any other stock that you've seen short, short squeezes and whatnot, right? So GameStop, there's a lot of stocks, right? So if you do an analysis, and this is all mathematics, by the way, and just in case people are new here, everything I do is layered on mathematics, right? So, and apologies if I'm not reading the chat, I just wanna go through this little GameStop intro and we'll talk, a, talk about it in a lot more detail tomorrow during a math stream, right? So if you look at the data in the markets, look at the stock in the markets, stocks in the markets right you can dig down multiple layers and figure out what's going on with each different stock if the insiders are buying if the insiders are selling which head funds might be invested in them the top ones anyway right um you can look at the chart with the prices done over time and you can find out uh, what the short position is on any stock that allows shorting right because there's derivatives there's uh, puts you can buy calls you can buy there's multiple derivatives in play right so a whole bunch of people got together or one person got together or a handful of people got together and they started analyzing the markets analyzing the stocks and this isn't something new that has happened on wall street bets or uh it's something new that has happened in the last few months this is something that's been going on forever since the stock market came into existence right so a handful of people got together and started looking at information some of mo most likely a lot of these people were individuals looking at the markets they got onto a forum right started talking and saying hey listen i've been looking at this stock this is what the short position is this is what their revenue is this is what their cost of revenue is this is what their p is this is what their stocks doing and then other people started sharing their information and as a collective right they started filtering out the ones that they really weren't interested in playing the way they wanted to play it because the markets right the stock markets there are multiple games at play in the stock market. People can do different things in the stock market, right? So these people decided to say, okay, what we're gonna do, or what I want to do, or what we should do, is pick the stocks that have the largest short interest, right? And pick the stocks that really don't deserve to be beaten down by hedge funds to that level, to be shorted to that level, right? And People have to appreciate this as well in the markets okay you can make money on the way up and you can make money on the way down right when you short a stock you're making money on the way down right if the stock is allowed to be sold short <laughs> if the stock is allowed to be sold short what you can do is sell stocks in that company that you don't even have right so let's say there's a million shares in this stock and all of them are in people's hands big money can come in and start selling shares that they don't even have they borrow shares and sell at a certain price pushing the stock price down and then they buy it at a lower price the borrowed shares it's all fake right the borrowed shares and they make the money difference right so they've been pushing this stock down for a year or whatever it is and they do this to multiple stocks and they built a position anywhere between 100 to 150 140 150 percent short position on the stock that means when there's let's say a million million the cats are awesome if there's a million um um, what do you call it? the float in the on this uh, the company is a million they sold an extra million to a million and a half shares in this company that didn't even exist fictitious shares and they push the stock down now what happens when you short something if you short it at a certain price when the stock price goes down you sell it at this price you cover your short you make the difference right if the stock goes up and you 
have to cover your shorts that means the stock is getting away from you and if you were forced to buy it at a high price you have to cover that difference right so if you shorted at ten dollars the stock goes down to five and you buy it back at five this imaginary share you make five dollars profit if the stock goes up to 15 then you you're forced to cover this buy this back now you're paying an extra five dollars per share that you sold so you're losing five dollars what happened was a bunch of people got together right the caller is on the cast mom is it oh i gotta go check it out Chicho. let's check it out Oh, poor kitty. I got the collar. Okay. Chicho, actually, listen. Loosen the collar. There's a, actually, you might have to tighten it if it's too tight. This is the first time this happened. We just put the collar on a couple of days ago. I was trying to... Oh, really? He was scratching it. He's got the... Even before we put on the collar, he was scratching his neck. Yeah. <laughs> I got scratched a little bit right but that's okay he was like oh poor kitty we got it we, we have to put collars on him at some point right oh you guys were telling me so early on whoever doesn't have the collar via kicks against okay, the other cat has submitted oh help the cat dude please help me oh yeah oh man i didn't realize it was a couple of minutes like that right i have been living in put options on a better way to short limited da, da, da. chicho he was trying to get it off for five minutes and that was the result thank you yeah my pleasure i'm gonna go get him go bring him back here so they can chill okay i'm gonna give him some treats actually okay They're doing good. One of them, one of them, they both went and started drinking water. One of them went to the uh, the pooper to take care of business, and the other one is eating some food. So I'll go get them in about uh, in a minute or so, in a couple of minutes, two or two to five minutes or so. Okay. Uh, as far as the the, the play goes, <laughs> GameStop play goes. This is what happens when you start talking about the markets, right? You forget about everything else. A lot of things that are important right such as kitty cats so what happened was these people got together and said hey this company GameStop doesn't deserve to be pushed down so far or maybe it did right maybe their business plan sucks but what happened which one is the badass uh, Sal is the badass elder God Sal is the badass via is gentle the one with the collar is the badass right which doesn't have a collar now my hat cut a collar for a while, but the dog kept unlatching it when he was, uh, oh really, that's what happened. They were wrestling, playing. Okay, hold on, one of them is back. Come on, yeah, come here. Come on. What's up? Yeah. guys some treats you're good kitties yeah i know i know i know i know there one for you here's one for you Come here. 
yourself. Come on. This one is Via. Via is so nice and chill. My hands are a little wet, Via. For kitty cats, we have, uh, right now we've set up two places for them to have water. One of them is, uh, has a water fountain as well. Cats love running water. <laughs> you see the battles now? This is so cute. Chicho, can I send 10 pounds of catnip to you? <laughs> Actually, check this out, Big Bobber. Uh, we have catnip, right? Uh, and we gave them, I tried giving them catnip a couple of days ago, and they were like, what's this, right? So catnip uh, desire hasn't kicked in yet. Uh, and I believe for some cats, it doesn't kick in. Yeah, and that's the kicker with Robin Hood, right? Don't eat that. He's going after my core. Let's play with cats, gang. We'll talk about the uh, game stop tomorrow during the math, the drama today. Chicho, I know the trick. You know the trick. You have to crumble and rip apart the cat. That's what we did. I did that. It didn't work. Don't eat my. No, oh, he's eating the Velcro. He likes it. We're going to play with kittens. Love this guy. This one is Sal. <laughs> Look at that. He's like, he's like a dog. He carries it away.
show. I'm gonna close off my camera, gang.
What's going on? What's going on?
jump. Nice jump.
<laughs> Let's see if they'll... <laughs> they'll need a little break. They'll need a little break. <laughs> super fun, super fun. And when they wrestle together like this, super fun. They go crazy. Bah, boom, 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 boom. Just watch your latest video. Hope you were able to get the comic stuff sorted. I'm uh, not yet top fiver. I still haven't sorted it out yet. But thanks, our charter days. Loving them. This is the first time I've ever living with kittens. And man, they are crazy fun. They are crazy fun. And very well behaved. Very well behaved. Very well behaved. Yeah. There they go. <laughs> They're probably going to go get some munchies or some more water or something. We've opened up the space. Uh, we've closed off some space uh, so they can't access. So they have access to about two thirds uh, of the space that we have. And about a third of it is closed off where. I do my work, comic books, uh, guest room is closed off. We can't have Barney's. Chicho, do cats actually have fun when they chase toys? Or Oh, I'm guessing they do, for sure. Otherwise, I'm assuming they wouldn't do it. Uh, they, they're, not, um, they're not supposed to be outdoor cats. And our neighborhood is a rough neighborhood for cats. So what I'm going to do uh, in the spring, towards the end of winter, is create our patio in a way where uh, they can go out in the, into the patio but we're not going to allow them to go out in the neighborhood our previous cat um, that we had that passed away like three years ago now three or four years ago now uh, he used to go out a lot he was an outdoor cat and uh, at that time when he was going out there was like five cats in our neighborhood and every now and then we hear cat fights and stuff like this now our cat previous cat was a very gentle cat but uh you know he could take care of himself uh, but there were some bully cats around and we have raccoons in our that come up our driveway and we had birds of prey in our area so not yet they're not going to go out not yet they're just five months old <laughs> here they come <laughs> three more server days to go this is helping awesome elder god maybe you should extend it for one more month <laughs> we can't have barneys wire nets around the patio or an outdoor cage really helps them adjust to the outdoors yeah we're gonna i'm gonna put a wire mesh around the railings right but for example last summer we had uh, a raccoon come up into our uh, patio and he was munching on the grapes so we, i'm gonna make sure the pathway the stairs down the patio is closed off with a mesh uh, because uh, you know uh, we want to make sure they're okay are you joking i would kill some <laughs> Elder God regarding the next <laughs> See, uh, check out uh, Sal. He's scratching his neck. So, uh, Via doesn't scratch it, uh, his neck, but Sal scratches his neck. So, maybe we'll put the collar on Via and see how that works out. You could do it. Easy peasy. Yeah, I'm with Cheryl, Elder God. If you wanted to, you could do it. Right? Really, for me, uh, there's been periods of my life where uh, I didn't drink for a few years. I decided to cut it out, right? And same goes with cannabis, right? Same goes with cannabis. That being said, diet thug, thank you for the tier one sub. Supporting a father of two, thanks. It's taken a lot of work, gang, to get the cow, uh, the house, uh, cat friendly kitten friendly we had to do a lot of like there's a like in the background we've been so crazy busy just getting the place set up right so the kittens could come they'd be safe and whatnot right 
the real MC Mike. This video and the kitties are super helpful for studying for my vector calculus exam next week. Awesome. What a great morning. Thank my pleasure. My pleasure, MC Mike. I hope you do well on the test. Elder God, I'm British. It's what we do. <laughs> That's one thing, gang. When I traveled to Europe, I couldn't believe the amount of alcohol being consumed there. And that being said, cherry liqueur. Uh, the cherries, right? Fantastic snack. Chisho. Thoughts Wall Street manipulating the markets. Chabobs, we talked about it a little bit earlier. And then my cat had his collar get stuck in his mouth, so I have to go deal with that. Tomorrow morning, during a math stream, I'm going to, at the beginning, I'm assuming. If a math question comes up, we'll deal with the math questions and we'll do it at the end. But tomorrow during a math stream, I'm going to set up aside a little bit of time to talk about what's going on with GameStop, the markets, stock market in general, and the game at play. Okay. And that way I, I, I can have the board and show everything. The Dolphin, hey, Chicho. When you do decide whether it's time to take a break from alcohol or cap, uh, when do when um, for me, if I find myself being addicted to anything uh, or dependent on anything, I cut it out. I don't like anything external governing governing my way of being. Right. So if I find myself that I can't do without something. I stop consuming that thing. That's when I, that's me keeping control of my own life. Right? Thank you. We do our best to keep it cozy, uh, Bridges. It's just uh, the way I decided to live for many, many, many years. Oh, the kitten's got one of the toys. I have some of these toys hanging from places where they go around and just play with the play with the toys hanging. Boredom prevention, yeah. We can't have Barney's. It's been eleven months since I've last smoked. The paranoia keeps creeping on me, so I really don't like smoking unless if I have fi uh, find a strain that suits my needs. Cool. Kevals, regardless, I've made a lot of money from this, so I'm happy. Awesome, awesome. Happy for you, kebabs. Yeah, Elder God. Um, and I used to do that as well. And what I ended up doing is uh, realize that that can lead into bad habits. So I stopped being bored, tried to stop being bored. Tink, how are you doing? Cute cast. My sister's getting the very first dog our family has ever had on Monday. Awesome, congrats. MOD day off. On Charter Days, Chicho, I'm trying to learn mathematics. I haven't touched the subject since I was in high school. Graduated university near two years ago. Do you have any advice on how to start? Um, on Charter Days, I would say start off with the basics, right? Uh, just look at how to deal just straight up algebra a lot of people forget how to deal with fractions and fractions are ridiculously important so just if you if you're okay with you just doing algebra as meditation like adding subtracting fractions multiplying fractions uh, combining like terms solving for equations just do some of that just 
practice that if you want visuals learn how to graph a line again and once you learn how to graph a line learn how to graph quadratic functions which is basically completing the square and there's like three different methods of graphing a quadratic function or two main different methods of well two main methods of graphing a quadratic function learn the two ways of graphing a quadratic function that's fantastic practice okay and then once you build up your skills to a level where you're comfortable with all your algebra right you're comfortable with graphing and functions get into trigonometry and uh, get into generating the function for like uh, tides of the ocean or a ferris wheel and stuff like that all right and by the way what i just said if you're starting off with just the basics of algebra it will take you a long time to get to that level right depending on where you are right so deal with each one of those first okay and gang don't forget free assange free assange free assange julian assange is a publisher and journalist that is being crucified for trying to bring transparency and accountability of capitalist power to humanity right for more information you can check out our julian assange and wikileaks playlist dolphin i'm sorry i haven't been keeping up with your content are you still tutoring math for sure dolphin tomorrow morning 8 30 a.m pst my time and uh today at 4 p.m pst my time we start talking about education okay the fire is very cozy supreme leader of twitch cider was an addiction but it's been 2.5 months since i drank that awesome elder god i find cider heavy man a, a lot of sugar a tremendous amount of sugar dolphin finding roots by factoring or quadratic formula are the two methods i think cool dolphin yeah uh factoring finding cube roots fourth root square root of just uh natural numbers is a good way just to get that practice going it's very visual it's pretty break it down and then graphing quadratics is important and then apply that to finding maximum revenue of something finding the maximum area of something right oh you got it this will go with mathematics earlier still looks like a trojan horse to me elder god funny we can have barney's okay i'm gonna teach okay i'm gonna allow that it, twitch didn't like uh, uh what do you call it uh who was that what kind of barney's uh, twitch didn't like facial video a uh, beard can you make a new beard i've been meaning to man i just love my goatee right now so much and i do go through trimming it every now and then but the trimming <laughs> trimming takes me like <laughs> like i swear shaving and trimming my beard takes me a total of like less than two minutes and that's one reason i love the goatee right it keeps me with facial hair and maintaining it is like super ridiculously easy slick mick for me what i really needed to refresh was using trigonometry to solve real world problems um integrating and differentiate integrating and differentiation hugely improved as well in graphing exponentials exponentially a area under the curve etc my two my two cents yeah and using derivative to uh, graph once you are able to graph quadratic functions you can go into graphing poly, uh, polynomials of higher degree than degree two, which are quadratic functions, right? So graphing polynomials or any other function uh, by finding the uh, restrictions, finding the asymptotes, vertical, horizontal, the holes, and then graphing that way is, is pretty good to do. And free Assange, other God. Uncharted Day, Chicho, thank you for it. My pleasure, Uncharted Day dolphin <laughs> he got scared he ran off <laughs> they play hide and seek and wrestle a lot uh we kind of burning is that where we go dolphin how do you think biden uh will deal with assange and how would have trump dealt with it how should have trump uh dealt with it? trump should have pardoned assange he was a foolish 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 puppet that didn't and puppet is the optimal word as far as biden goes business as usual man it's a one-party system right 
Hey, Chicho, can you make a new? Yeah, yeah, beard. Yeah, I we can learn this. I'll get maybe spring. Okay, uh, end of spring. Okay, remind me again. It's been a while since I did one. We gotta do. We gotta do. I try today, Chicho. Is it okay if tomorrow you go? Uh, you go some basic algebra for sure we can go into some basic algebra 100 percent on charter days pop up tomorrow if you pop up early we'll deal with that first and then we'll do the market mathematics uh, or my explanation of the markets the twitch try to uh censor me i they did twitch uh our bot uh i don't know if it's a bot i think it's twitch didn't like facial for obvious reasons right but man that's the problem with automation with bots they're not thinking human beings <laughs> elder god sal i want sal. sal elder god i knew it sal is like he's uh, it's very they're brothers totally different characters uh via is very submissive right like when via is eating food sal will pop in and go poof bump via and via goes okay you eat right and then sal eats the food funny funny initially uh we were only gonna get one via and then uh we talked about it and decided to go with two and sal was my my choice uh to get there were four kittens one of them was already spoken for there was three and i liked via i like sal i like via too they're awesome supreme leader of twitch why is twitch suddenly censoring random words in chat and turning them into asterisks i don't remember ever enabling such a thing feels uh feels bad brother a censorship is a horrendous thing censorship is the downfall of humanity right especially when bots are doing it as well <laughs> like <laughs> you doing a good cleaning yeah you do Bezos is taking taking your freedom of speech away. Indeed. <laughs> this should be censored. Blur out. <laughs> Funny. Right. Context matters. It feels like Twitch sensor sensor bot is very aggressive. Very aggressive. Hello, crafter. How are you doing? Oh my god, so so crazy times we live in. Haha, <laughs> indeed. I wish I could do that. <laughs> oh my God, that reminds me of a Bill Hicks. <laughs> that reminds me of a Bill Hicks joke. Is uh, he says, uh, "Ladies, Bill Hicks is one of his stand up because ladies, if men could do what cats do, you'd be sitting in the audience alone right now." <laughs> What are your thoughts on the extreme censorship in China? I think extreme censorship sucks everywhere. Young Bola's laugh at my ass. <laughs> censorship. Look, prohibition and censorship. Those are two things that have been on my top list to be against my whole life. Okay. F censorship, F prohibition, period end of story anybody that defends censorship of any kind is a as far as i'm concerned is a is is either a uh, either is a fascist that knows that they are fascist or they are just useful idiots for fascists it, i don't care what censorship it is okay <laughs> look at him go gang i learned something getting the two kittens if you're gonna get a kitten get cats get two i can't even imagine what their lives would have been like if they were separated if they didn't have each other to play with really All right telegram was getting removed from apple well that's my prediction i think telegram what did telegram do the google tried to censor it or something didn't they crafter last final of the semester tomorrow evening awesome crafter congrats congrats 
what a shit show education has become schooling has become we'll talk more about that uh, this afternoon we're doing another live stream at 4 4 p.m pst right in how many hours in six hours <laughs> My first cab was a 1988 elder god wow 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 supreme uh, leader of twitch yeah the attempt to censor harmful words and hate speech is pretty silly it's extremely subjective yeah and cancel culture cancel culture is censorship cancel it's crazy right dolphins some people are patriotic to this thing extent when they support their government censoring i see this happening Turkish independent media quite yeah and uh, once you brought up Turkey uh, Turkey there was a reporter in Turkey uh, Henrik Henrik Dink that got assassinated because he was writing about the Armenian genocide and he got assassinated like 10 years ago or something like this right uh, Turkey is totalitarian state it's it censored up the yin yang if you speak out like personally a person like me could never live in turkey or any totalitarian state like this right because if you speak out you get disappeared right i try to this we only have one cat at the moment and you are right they get they get lonely they get lonely look at look at them play right i'm doing my exams for the semester as well still three still three to go Ooh six hours thanks elder god in 2007 the pub i worked at had six cats six cats outdoor cats i'm assuming or were they all indoors that's awesome that pub had no mouse or rat problem right i'm assuming elder god is that correct harant yeah no, not hendrik harant thank yeah thank you very much sonny that was the reporter that uh, got assassinated in turkey because he wrote about the armenian genocide like facts right like it's not even disputed what he wrote and a fanatic and there's a lot of fanatics in turkey assassinated him mc mike that reminded me i wanted to share this resource about censorship and data uh, privacy uh we can all use his name is rob baxman you can uh and you can find him on youtube aka sensor tube or um no links you can't provide links mc mike so if you're going to share links you should uh share it on our discord page uh, which is better than sensor tube i'm assuming that's bit is that bit you're linking to anyways check him out and he does a great job explaining the concept and how to protect yourself cool yeah link it up on our discord uh mike in uk you need a good reason to leave the country and inside only but had a big garden had a big garden cool look at the cats go eh <laughs> nice nice and they love gang if you have a kitty cat get yourself one of these tunnels they love this tunnel they absolutely love the tunnel okay thanks mike linking it up dolphin what do you feel your cats uh what do you feed your cats you show uh you know what that department is my partner's department like for me I was okay not not getting cats right one reason is i don't like the shedding gang balinese lynx balinese kittens no shedding no hair right so i'm in love i really i'm in love okay however both these cats are my partner's cats okay she was the one yeah cheryl like no hair like <laughs> zero i've never ever even heard of this i've heard about you know a hypoallergenic and stuff like this i've met dogs and cats that are hypoallergenic and stuff but they still shed like they might shed in the spring right but 
<laughs> like there's no I shed I I give off more hair than they do a lot of extra dust or not really no uh, a lot of extra dust or not really no I haven't noticed anything they've only been here for a week though so uh, as far as feeding the cats dolphin my partner's got some uh, wet food because kittens have to eat wet food and from what I understand she's done all this she's she bought the cats she bought the standing thing there and we have another one here she bought the top she bought all all these cushions for the cats like as you, if you can if if you've seen we had a carpet here so it was a, a cashmere carpet so i removed that right so we got these things for the cat so we did a lot of prep work right but she got everything and from what she's told me uh, male kittens and male cats need to drink a lot of water because they get dehydrated so they have kidney problems if they don't drink a lot of water as far as kittens go she's feeding them both wet food and dry food right so wet and dry <laughs> look at him go <laughs> awesome uh, so both wet and dry every now and then we give them little treats uh, we're treat we're uh, teaching them not to go on the table so we re we have and one thing if you want to train your cats tin foil is fantastic we put tin foil on the table they were going on the table put tin foil on the table they're not going on the coffee table they're not going on the coffee table we put tin foil on the ledge so they won't go on the ledge in certain areas where we have fragile things so we're still working on it uh, but food wise it's a drug uh, wet food and dry food if you want i could get a list of what she's feeding them and i could post it on our discord oh is that the elder god is that the uh the american it, was he japanese chinese i think he's american chinese is that the guy you've been linking up on our discord on our discord page if it, if it is he's phenomenal that he also has a vpn that you could uh, subscribe to that you could get is that the guy and gang don't forget don't forget free assange free assange free assange julian assange is a publisher and journalist that is being crucified for trying to bring transparency and accountability of capitalist power to humanity more information on Julian Assange and WikiLeaks playlist. The real MC Mike. Same Elder God. I really uh, into data privacy and cybersecurity now. Whenever I have free time, nice. I can't go. Oh, <laughs> it just crumbled. <laughs> Probably beating a dead horse at this point. But what do you think of the stock market situation that's occurring? Uh, man Madal Zuna one. Oh wow, they're so so so. Yeah, they're very. Uh, we talked a little about a little bit about a little bit about uh, GameStop and what's going on in Marcus earlier in the stream, and we're gonna get into it tomorrow morning during our math stream, starting at 8:30 uh, a.m. Okay, so we have a two-hour math stream tomorrow, and I'm gonna probably take about anywhere between half an hour to an hour to explain to everyone my perspective of what's going on tin foil wow i had no idea yeah dolphin tin foil like this table where i have the camera set up and the mic set up is covered with tin foil because they were going on this um the counters we had we put foil and they're not even going on there anymore um uh, there's a ledge we have that we don't want them to go there because it's got a huge fall so we put foil there they're not going there it works amazing is the cooker cat safe cooker cat no way of them getting behind it uh, they can go behind it behind the fireplace and it's safe the only thing they did back there was scrape off a little bit of the uh, metal it's not metal but it is metal and they were chewing on it so we took those out of it so uh we vacuumed up oh that was a great attack nice donuts this is like cat wwe 
in a minute one's going to bring out this <laughs> steel chair <laughs> oh he's filipino yeah that guy fantastic he lived in hell as a young man yeah i can imagine i really like him and thanks for introducing us uh, on discord to that elder god fantastic Real MC Mike. Okay, I shared the Rob Bax, uh, Braxman link in the general chat on Discord. Thank you very much. And by the way, MC Mike, we do have a privacy and censorship folder on Discord as well. So if you're on Discord still, link those up in our privacy folder. That way we're keeping things organized so people can access information in the appropriate places. And it's the uh, ring dive. Knockout, boom. <laughs> Fun. Alagot, for messaging, I'm currently using Signal and Telegram for now. Yeah, here's the thing with uh, MC Mike, Signal. Uh, Jack Dorsey from Twitter is promoting Signal. And I think he has a stake in Signal. If Dorsey has a stake in Signal, I'm not using Signal. Okay. So... I'm not cool with anything Jack Dorsey is doing. He can go to hell. I'm still on Twitter, but that's for now. Nothing else that he gets involved in, I will participate in. Okay. F Jack Dorsey. Okay. Three of the pub cats were killed when they got struck. Oh, stuck behind the cooker. Death by. Oh, no. Elder God. Boo. Crafter. I'm kind of scared that Discord is going to get. Uh, punish sometime soon well they took uh, uh, and then by the way if this discourse gets taken out if our discord gets taken out gang message me we'll start a whole new server on telegram okay if telegram gets taken out we'll do movements okay if we reach a point where discord is getting iffy we'll create a secondary folder where we share information we have it and we'll constantly remind people to join there just in case decentralize 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 right that like i usually just use smoke signals and carrier pigeons <laughs> let me see my i got rid of twitter and all things facebook yeah i deleted all my friends on facebook except one that i'm waiting to hear from and two that are the other accounts that i used to, that i have actually one is 420 math the other one math in real life so i deleted everyone and my facebook image profile pic is a facebook uh pixelated fu <laughs> and i've told and some of my uh some of the people that i know there my friends on there have joined me on telegram now okay apple is thinking about removing telegram because they're having to deal with bs lawsuits from hate speech watch groups well, F Apple. I'm, I barely do. I don't think I use anything Apple, to tell you the truth. Right? So, uh, and gang, at some point, uh, Apple, and if, if it's not happening now, hopefully it's going to happen sooner. Apple's going to start losing market share. Right? Even th though Telegram does remove extremist neo Nazis. Yeah. Dr. Soviet. Dolphin, if all else fails, just point uh, joint parlor. <laughs> yeah, they, they keep on saying to, uh, if you don't like our platforms, just create your own, create your own. And then people create their own. And then they censor them, they block them, they deplatform them. They don't allow them to uh, generate funds. They kick them off uh, searches, Google. They kick them off payment systems. Build your own. Mm, we did. People did and you kill them it's like the bds movement right they say oh pa palestinians should protest uh peacefully and then they start a peaceful protest and then they try to knock that off and call that hate speech because it's working right elder god chicho i have been looking for a discord alternative let us know what it is elder god matrix key base and gilded as uh, as good okay simple tron 2000 I was off Facebook. For oh. <laughs> Did you hear that tin foil? So this is Sal. It's got to be Sal. 
This is Sal. Sorry about the noise, gang. Sal. And he was trying to get into the... Oh, he's... I put the toys up there. Hold on a second. 